Hello guys, welcome back to class. Today I'm going to be explaining you really, really quick the vocabulary that is related to the shops. This vocabulary, I don't remember what's the name of the page, what's the number of the page, sorry. But you guys can check it on the student's book, whatever. So let's start. As you guys know, as you guys can see, all the vocabulary is going to be related to shops. So some of the words are very common and they're very simple, but actually we have some words if you remember the book is British. So we are going to have some words that are not very common for you. So, but don't worry about it. I'm going to be explaining you some of the meanings that we have over here. So, let's start first with bakery. This one is like a place where you can buy actually bread, cakes, donuts, all the stuff. All that delicious stuff. Yeah. So, let's continue with bookshop. Bookshop is basically like a bookstore. A place where you can buy books. Magazine, actually. Then we continue with butcher. Butcher, sorry. The butcher is a place where you buy meat, uh, chicken, beef, pork, meat, whatever. Yeah, just meat in general. We continue with the chemist. The chemist is like uh, another way to say a pharmacy. Yeah, as simple as that. I forgot it. The clothes shops. The word is telling you that uh, the clothes shop is a place where you can buy clothes. Then we continue over here with the apartment store. The apartment store is like the, the, the stores that we know, such as uh, Liverpool, uh, Palas de Hierros, Sears, all those ones, where you can buy different articles. They don't sell a specific type of articles, but they just sell some random stuff in general, yeah, to be honest. Let's continue with an electrical shop. That one is like the one that we know has Best Buy. So yeah, you can you actually buy some elect electronical devices there, and yeah. Well, let's continue over here with green browsers. The green browsers is basically like uh, like a little market where you especially buy only fruit and vegetables. Yeah, fruit and vegetables over here. Uh, then we then we continue with the jewelers. The jewelers, the word is telling you they sell basically jewelry. Then we continue with the news agents. That one is like a little stand that is on the street and you can buy some newspaper, some magazines. They're very common in downtown, but they're not very common anymore here in Saudi, I guess. Well, whatever. The post office, that one is not a shop, but post office, very simple. Shoe shop, don't worry, telling you that. Sport shop, uh, like, you know, a sport. Those kind of stores that sell you only like, yeah, whatever. So let's continue with a stationery shop. The stationery shop is basically like a place where you buy school supplies such as scissors, rulers, yeah, just stuff in general. And finally, we have the supermarket, such as the ones that we know have, such as Walmart, Soriana, those ones. So in my opinion, the most difficult ones over here are gonna be, well, if we consider it difficult, will be bakery, the butcher, Butcher, sorry, the chemist, we can say it that way. Um, the green browsers, the jewelers, news agents, remember, and stationery shop, probably. So, I will send you some exercises so you guys can start answering it with the vocabulary that we have over here. Yeah, so if you guys have any questions or any doubts about the vocabulary, or if you don't remember, What's the meaning for all of them? Just let me know by sending me a message. Have a nice day and I'll see you guys later. Bye.